in Houston, through our legal work over, over the course of years, we've identified a lot of millions of gallons of untreated sewage going back into our waterways in Houston. And Leverage the Clean Water Act to see to, to, to say that these are violations and that um, and, and this all resulted in a, a consent decree, a 15 year consent decree to clean up our waterways. And not only did we do that, the other thing that I'm proud of is that we also are tracking that through our justice in the sewers map. And, and I think the, this is a good example of that intersectional sort of work that's needed, that layered approach. It's not enough to just have that data. The city of Houston is mandated to share their progress on the consent decree. This is how many sewage overflows are still going into the, the community. So we constantly monitor that data, but we won't, we won't stop at that. We also parrot that data with census tract data because we can see the zip code and then we can see the, the race and ethnicity. That's when you learn that this is an environmental justice issue, that untreated sewage is going into blacker and browner communities and certain zip codes that have already had compounded injustices that have happened. Mm -hmm.